Father, we thank you. We bring a special session in honor of our nation, Nigeria. Father, I want to thank you for that which you have been doing for us as a nation. Thank you for keeping us. Thank you for sustaining us. We want to start by saying we are sorry, Lord. Sorry for the ways we have been willful in our disobedience. Willful in the path of self-destruction. Because all that we are going through is man-made. Is the case of man's inhumanity to man. A case of utter disregard for your creation, the human being. Disregard for the laws of the land and for your constituted laws. And so we've come to say we are sorry, Lord. We've come to say we are sorry, Lord. 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 Oh, yes. We are sorry, Lord. We are sorry, Lord. We are sorry, Lord. We are sorry, Lord. We are sorry, Lord, oh yes. We are sorry, Lord. We are sorry, Lord. We are sorry, Lord. We are sorry, Lord, oh yes. We are sorry, Lord. We are sorry, Lord. That on behalf of our nation, Nigeria, we stand to say we are sorry. Sorry, Lord, for every act that has been inimical to your goodwill for us. Because there's no doubt that you love us. There is no doubt that you care for us. There is no doubt that we are special in your eyes. There is no doubt that we are wonderfully and wonderfully made, powerfully made. Your hands of mercy have sustained us, prevailed, preserved, sustained. And so, Daddy, we say thank you. Thank you for all the love you've showered for us. And we are sorry for the ways we have replied negatively. And so, Daddy, we've come to say we are sorry. And to ask for your mercy. To ask for your mercy to ask for your mercy, your continued mercy. Because we have been here because of your mercy that has prevailed, your mercy that has sustained, your mercy that has been plenteous. <laughs> All the nations have not seen a little of what we have, and they are scattered and battered. But in all of our troubles, you have been there for us. You have been there for us. You have been there for us. Helping us, upholding us, sustaining us, guiding us. Overlooking our wrongs. Daddy, thank you. Daddy, thank you our past leaders and our present vice president sang a song 
Lord, I help in ages past. Our hope for years to come. Our shelter from the stormy wind and our eternal hope. You have always been our hope and our strength. That is why we have come interceding. We have come running to you. The God that is our help. Daddy, thank you. Father, we thank you. Daddy, we thank you. Thank you for that which you are about to do again. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Daddy, thank you. Father, we thank you. We come before you because you are the God of all flesh. The God that is able to do exceedingly abundantly. Above our expectations. In Exodus 3.14. You said to Moses that you are, you are the I am that I am. And so we come to you the God of all flesh. The God that is I am. Psalm 90 verse 2. From everlasting to everlasting thou art God. And that's why we we'll praise you. From everlasting to everlasting we we'll praise you. We we'll join the hosts of heaven. The 24 elders to worship. To acknowledge you. To exalt you. To magnify you. We will praise thee from everlasting. Everlasting to everlasting. We will praise you from everlasting. Everlasting to everlasting. We will praise you, Lord, from everlasting. Everlasting to everlasting. We will praise you from everlasting. Everlasting to everlasting. We will praise you from everlasting. Everlasting to everlasting. We will praise you from everlasting. Everlasting to everlasting. We will praise you from everlasting. Everlasting to everlasting. We will praise you, Lord, from everlasting. Everlasting to everlasting. Psalm 90, verse 2. From everlasting to everlasting, thou art God. Men may try to perpetrate their rule. Men may try to show how powerful they are. Men may hold others to ransom and exert their strength. But from everlasting to everlasting, thou art God. Man will come and go, but you remain at the same. Psalm 102, 24 to 27. Psalm 102, 24 to 27. Says the heavens. We remain. The earth shall perish, but thou shalt endure. Thou art the same, and thy years shall have no end. Thou art the same, and thy years shall have no end. Father, we worship. The God that has no beginning, that has no end, we worship. The God that is the same yesterday, today, and forever. All powerful, all knowing. We worship. We worship. Awesome God, mighty God. Awesome God, mighty God. We give you praise. You are highly lifted up, awesome God. You are highly lifted up, awesome God. I read Psalm 102, 24 to 27. Psalm 102, 24 to 27 says, Oh my God. 
We use our nation Nigeria to pray. So we say, oh, our God, take us not away in the midst of our days, of our years, and throughout all generations. We call upon you on behalf of our God. Of old, thou hast laid the foundations of the earth, and the heavens are the work of your hands. The heavens and the earth are the work of your hands. They shall perish. Men and their craftiness will perish. Men and their wickedness will perish. Men and their evil imagination will perish. But thou shalt endure. Yea, all of them shall wax old like a garment. Every day. We grow older, we wax old, but God remained the same. All of them, all of us shall wax old and be changed, but thou art the same. Psalm 102, 27, but thou art the same, and thy years have no end. The children of thy servants and their seed shall be established before thee. That's what we've come to cry for. That Nigeria will remain established before thee. That you overrule our wickedness, man's inhumanity to man, our selfishness, our greed, our covetousness, and let your mercy prevail. Let your mercy prevail. Let your mercy prevail over circumstances, over situations, in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Father, we say thank you. Daddy, we say thank you. Revelation 1, 8. You are the Alpha and the Omega, the beginning and the end, the God which is, which was, and which is to come. You are the Almighty. <laughs> Almighty Father, thank you. Almighty Father, thank you. We have nothing to give you, only to say thank you, Lord. Almighty Father, thank you. Almighty Father, thank you. Almighty Father, thank you. We have nothing to give you, only to say thank you, Lord. Almighty Father, thank you. Daddy, we have nothing to give you than to say thank you, than to bless you, than to appreciate you, because you have shown us mercy. And you continue to show us mercy. It's of your mercy that we have not been consumed. That is why we are here. To give you all the praise. To give you all the honor. On behalf of our nation. And the nations of the world. That we say thank you. They have not allowed COVID-19 to swallow everyone. We are grateful. We bless your holy name. Daddy, thank you.